welcome to part three of drawing our animated alien face. In this section, we're going to give our alien um, antennae. All right, so let's get started. So we're going to add a comment. Draws the left antennae. And then we'll need a point we're just going to make it a simple circle. And so we'll do a center point is equal to um, point. And we want it up in the left hand corner. So we'll try 50 and 60 for our x and y coordinates. And then we'll do L, A, N, T, E, N, N, E for left antennae is equal to circle. And then we'll call the center point and we'll make its radius 12. So L antennae dot draw on the canvas win. And L antennae dot set outline. And we're going to make it black. So we'll just take the color from the left eye or the right eye and then we'll do L antennae set um, whether you fill it or not is completely your op your option um, if you want to fill it we'll do set fill and we can call then call the color from the pupil give it that lighter brighter color and then we also might want to set the width so L antennae dot set width and let's make it pretty wide so let's try six you can always make it skinnier to give it kind of an outer edge or surface to it so let's go ahead and run it let's see what we get So there's our antennae. It seems to be a little bit off, so we want to move it a little bit over and up. So we'll try 65. And then to move it up, we'll reduce it. So we'll say 50 and run it again. And that's a little bit better. Uh, the exact position is, of course, up to you. And then what we need to do is we need to draw a line to his forehead. So um, we might want to go up and then down. So to do this, then we need to call a line which is made up of two points. So we'll do P1 is equal to point. And we want to start somewhere in the circle. So if our circle starts, if our center point is 64, and 50 down where we need and our width is 12 we, we need to add 12 to it so that's 76 and then we need to go up a little bit so we'll do 76 and 45 for our point one and then our point two is going to be equal to point and then it, we want it to go up and over so we're going to let's add 20 to 95 and let's subtract um, 15 so we'll say 30. So then we'll do um, what should we call it um, we'll just say left antenna line so LAL and then we'll do is equal to line and then we'll call P1 comma P2 and then we'll do LAL now notice this um, kinda looks like a 1 um, so it's up to you but we want to try to avoid confusion so we might want to put in 
left there instead of that the lowercase l and you can also do it here okay so then left and then we'll do dot draw to the canvas and then dot um, set outline and we'll use our black color again and then we'll set the width of the antenna to match the other one so left al dot set width let's make it a little bit smaller so let's try five and then we don't need to fill it because it's a line now that's going to be the line going up so let's go ahead and run it click OK and there you have your little bit line going up and now we just need a line going down so we'll go back to our code and we can do now we'll do P3 is equal to point and we'll use the same point that our last line ended with so that they're going to be attached and then P4 we're going to need to do a new point and this point is going to go down to the to the head at some location. All right, so then we're going we're going from 90 30 to basically let's try 130 and it's going to go down a ways so let's try 190. And then we'll do um, left al2 dot is equal to line p3 p4 and left al2 is equal to draw I'm sorry la2 dot draw win and left al2 dot set outline and then we'll go ahead and copy the color and then we can just copy the whole line make it easy on ourselves and just add a 2 to the width and make it 5 and if you even wanted to make it taper it a little bit maybe we'll change it to 4 so let's go ahead and run this and there's our antenna so we um, it's going down a little far and it still needs to go over a bit so let's try one 50 and 150 and rerun it and see if we like that. There we go. It's um, again it's totally up to you as for your preference about how far you want his antenna to go. You might want him farther up on the top of the head but I'm going to go ahead and leave it where it is for time's sake. Alright so then all we have to do then is copy this code to draw the right antenna and then edit it for our purposes. So we'll scroll down and then we'll say draw draws the right antenna and then we'll go ahead and change the points later so we're just going to say right and again if you want to save yourself some time you can copy and paste and change the lefts to right Now we just need to figure out um, the coordinates. So our first antenna circle is at 6450. So we want it to be at the same level. So all we want to do is to translate it over to the opposite side. It's 64 from the edge of the left edge, which is at zero. So if we want it symmetrical, we can make it 64 from the right edge. Um, which is 400 so minus 64 would be 336 so we'll just change this to 
336. And then we want it at the same height, maybe uh, to be just a little bit different. We might change the height down 15, so let's try 65, and we'll see how it looks. We still want the same, still want the same width of the antenna. We want the same color for the outer, for the outline, and we want the same color for the inner one. So then we need to look at our lines and. Our first point is at 70, 40, 75, 45. So again, we can, if we want to do this slightly symmetrical, we can subtract um, that number from, hold on one second. Um, yeah, we can subtract that number from the right side. So that would be instead of 400 it would be 325 so we'll try this and then we um, for our second point we want to go um, up this way so it's even less and we subtracted we, we added 25 so we want to go 25 less so we'll just do 300 and sorry 325 and then for our second line we want to do 300 second point on the line 300 and we still want it to go from 45 which is farther down up to 30 so then that should take care of that line now we want to do the down line so again our point 3 needs to match point 2 so we'll do 300 and 30 and then we want to go down and, and in, so we want to subtract. Last time we subtracted 25 from it. I'm sorry. Last time we added 60, so we want to subtract 60, so we'll try 220. I'm sorry, um, 240. And then we went. 120 so we'll we want to be relatively the same distance so we'll leave it at 150 so let's go ahead and run it click OK and now we have our two antennae and the only thing that's off a little bit is our circle so I mean you could leave it you know it could be something artistic but if you want to change it a little bit then all we have to do is um, change the center point it needs to be let's say up 10 so we'll do 46 um, this is the X sorry so let's say up 10 so 55 and then let's just try that I don't think it needs to run over so there we go now it's on the antennae so that's how to do two antennae for your animated alien, and I will see you in part four where we'll deal with the nose and the mouth.